Now, Southwest Florida is preparing for a washout this weekend. A live look at Englewood Beach in Charlotte County right now, where you can see the dark clouds overhead and we can see the wind whipping those palm trees. Charlotte County dealt with flooding during Hurricane Adalia earlier this year, and some are still dealing with the damage. Wake News reporter Julina Sperdo live in Charlotte County for us. Julina, how do people who live in the area feel about this storm? Well, I spoke with one neighbor who already moved his cars into a public garage because during Adalia, this very street flooded and several neighbors lost several cars. But overall, they don't expect this upcoming storm to have as bad of an impact. Their spirits are high and their main priority is still finishing up repairs from Adalia. Take a look at this road flooded. Homes also flooded and damaged. We get two interesting ones. Ian, it's a 120 year old house, nothing. No problems at all. Lost some gutters, no big deal. Mm -hmm. I tell you, 200 miles off the coast floods us out. Just uh, luck of the draw. This is what Dave Gammon's home looked like after Adalia. What was left in his home was wooden planks, tarps, and dirt. Now he has it mostly repaired. If you know it's coming, put stuff upstairs or <laughs> do whatever you can to, to help it. All new appliances ready to start living in his dream home once again. It's a big relief. It took a long time. Yeah. It wears you out. It's very hard, very hard with insurance. It's very hard dealing with everything else, but we got it all done. And right down the road from Gammon is John Peterman. He shared with me these photos of what the flooding looked like at his home during Adalia and told me he isn't too concerned it will be as bad this weekend, but he isn't taking any chances. The rain flooding and so that'll go down, you know, it'll take the time. It's, it's when it, if it breaches the seawall and comes up, then that's when we have, when we have problems. And these two homeowners say they are prepared for this weekend. Now, coming up at 7, you're going to hear more from them about their challenging process of repairing their homes, replacing their cars, and any tips they may have for these upcoming coastal flood warnings this weekend. Live in Charlotte County, Jolina Sferdo, Wink News. All right, Jolina, thank you. You can get interactive radar and severe weather notifications with our Wink Weather app. If you have your location on, the Wink Weather app will send you a notification of any severe or urgent weather warnings that are issued for your specific area.